Good morning everyone, it's Thursday morning and I'm wearing a little bit of Easter-y clothes. Even though outside it doesn't look anything like spring or Easter. But yeah. Yeah, I have a long weekend this week, so today is technically like a Friday even though it's Thursday, so yay! <laughs> um, but anyways, I'm gonna go to work now and I'll see you after work. Bye! Hey guys, so I'm home now. After work, I just went to the shop twice to buy stuff for our party tomorrow. We're having a housewarming. And, um, yeah, quite honestly, I'm a bit upset or confused right now and busy making dinner. So, not really in the happiest mood or chattiest mood. Um, yeah, I think I'll eat work out and then in the evening I'll try to vlog a bit again and let you in on what is weighing on my heart. Bye. Hey guys, so sorry I lied or not lied but didn't follow through while I'm finishing the vlog yesterday. Um, like I said, I was kind of upset and confused about some things and um, I think that also made me wake up at like 5 this morning. Luckily, I was able to take another nap. Just like stressing about all this stuff. Um, it's mainly to do with uh, dog adoption. So, I've always wanted a rescue dog. And in Finland, there aren't very many rescue dogs. Um, now, I've found some. But the options are also very small. And, you know, from... The ones that I picked out, it was, um, most of them were, like, energetic dogs, and they said in the things, like, oh, they bark a lot, and not suitable for apartments, and they need a big yard and stuff, so. But anyways, drama started, or not drama, but, um, I became really confused, because I was talking to one of my friends who's studying to be a vet, and she told me that bringing dogs from Spain or Romania to... Finland or other countries is like a huge problem that has caused the spread of some like diseases and ticks that like weren't found here before and have brought been brought over by rescue dogs so then it's kind of like you know I'm trying to do this good thing and now I'm finding out that even this good thing has like isn't a good thing and yeah it's really hard um Right now my game plan is to find a local vet here, somewhere in town, like maybe go to the office where if we had a dog, that's where I would take my dog and just ask their opinion about it. Um, I did talk to another girl online because ironically, right when all this was going on, um, this animal uh, group that I belong to on Facebook, someone was like, hey, here's my rescue dog. Like everyone comment pictures of your rescue dogs and everyone's like, you know, here's Roscoe from Spain, here's Mope from Romania, and I was like, hello, oh, why do all these people, like, get to do this, and I don't, or not get to do this, that's so stupid, that's like, the stupidest <laughs> excuse ever, but, you know, that's the mood I was in, but, yeah, so now I've decided that I'll find some local, ugh, what was I saying, yeah, so then, um, on that post, I commented, like, this could be me um soon but i recently found out some negative stuff and you know i don't want to spread negative hippity on this post so could someone please message me if they have some experience and i was talking with this girl and she's saying like yeah it's true that some things have been brought over but if you get it from a legit organization you should be okay so i really want a professional opinion I want to find some local vet and ask them their opinion of that because I did also read somewhere and someone was like, vets don't even want to have you as a client. And I was like, I haven't heard that experience anywhere else except for that one post. So, you know, I want to go ask the vet what their opinion is about it. And is it good or is it really that bad? And does it depend what organization you get it from or not? Or is it just as bad a problem either way? But yeah. Um... So today we're having our housewarming party, so sorry if the dishwasher is loud, but I have to clean. I actually had, because I woke up at 5 and then took a nap around 7, 
and I had the most stressful dream that I slept until 6, which is when the party starts. And then in the dream, I was like vacuuming while guests are kind of arriving or my close friends are here and trying to make food and nothing was ready and yeah, super stressful. But yeah, so I'm gonna clean for a bit still and then probably do just like a light, easy cardio workout because I did quite a hard kettlebell one yesterday. And since I'm drinking tonight, I don't really want to exhaust my muscles too much because they're not gonna have much of a recovery tonight. So yeah, just some nice light cardio just to get into a happier mood in general. And yeah, maybe, oh yeah, well, I will talk to you later at least to close it out. Probably won't be vlogging that much today because I have a lot to do, but that would be a good reason to vlog. I've already spoken for like four minutes. It's gonna be the longest vlog ever. Oh, I feel a little bit crazy. I was really trying to like remove stuff and add stuff. But yeah, anyways, stuff for the party is pretty much done, except I still have no idea what I'm gonna wear. But other than that, things are quite ready, so I'm going to end the vlog here. I think, yeah, we'll end it here. Um, thank you for watching. Hit the like button if you liked it and subscribe to see me. Ooh, we're all blue.